in anti-aging and some other subjects through Rekindle School in Seattle. I'm also the administrator of the Facebook group Anti-Aging and Life Extension. Because these classes are focused on anti-aging, people often ask how old I am. I'm currently 68 at the time that I'm making this video. In this video, I'll be focusing on glutathione and the aging process. Nothing in this video is intended as or should be taken as medical advice. Glutathione is one of several molecules that decline during aging. This is similar to the way that levels of NAD, nitric oxide, human growth hormone, phosphatidylserine, and several other compounds that are essential to life go into a steep decline as the years go by. One approach to anti-aging is to replace these compounds by supplementing with them or supplementing with precursors that raise levels of them in the body. So as glutathione levels sink, our cells and tissues become more vulnerable to damage from stressors. Raising glutathione appears to, number one, slow the aging process, number two, improve immune function, number three, reduce inflammation and oxidative damage, number four, promote cardiovascular health, number five, slow cancer progression, number six, protect against neurodegenerative disease, number seven, minimize cell damage from liver disease, and number eight, improve insulin resistance. So a really important question might be, can we raise glutathione or can we stop it from decreasing as the years go by? And the answer fortunately is yes. There are a number of things that we can do. Number one, exercising. In a study that was published in 2014, researchers noted that older adults who had participated in regular physical activity throughout their lives had higher levels of glutathione. Number two, taking NAC, N-acetylcysteine. I should note here that at the time of this video, Amazon has stopped selling NAC due to a dispute with the FDA, but it's still available from other online forums such as Life Extension and several other companies. Number three, taking glycine. Taking glycine with NAC appears to have a synergistic effect. According to a 2021 study that was published in Clinical and Translational Medicine, older individuals taking a combination of glycine and NAC experienced improvements in mitochondrial function, oxidative stress, inflammation, insulin resistance, endothelial function, body fat, genomic toxicity, muscle strength, gait speed, exercise capacity, and cognitive function. So again, that was from the combination of NAC and glycine. Number four, taking milk thistle. Now, many people are already taking milk thistle along with berberine because it helps absorption. It also independently increases glutathione. Number five, optimizing our sleep. I would recommend aiming for seven or more hours per night. And there are some advantages, possibly, to going to bed earlier and getting up earlier because it puts us in better synchronization with our circadian rhythms when we do that. So some people in the anti-aging community have shifted to trying to go to bed or get to sleep by around 10 and then maybe getting up around 4.30 or 5 or 5.30 in the morning. Number six, taking selenium or eating foods that are naturally high in selenium. The kind that I take is thorin selenomethionine. Number seven, eating sulfur rich foods such as eggs or egg yolks, garlic and broccoli. Personally, I believe that we should probably be eating at least one food that's rich in sulfur every day and make sulfur a staple in our diets if our goal is to live long, healthy lives.
Number eight, eating whey protein. I take whey protein myself on my resistance training days. Number nine, if you drink milk, either drinking goat milk or drinking the kind of cow's milk with A2 beta casein. And number 10, taking vitamin C or eating vitamin C rich foods. So those are some of the key things that you might think about. This video is sponsored by Do Not Age, a source for high quality anti-aging supplements. I take several of their products myself, including NAD, resveratrol, hyaluronic acid, and CERT6 activator. For a 10% discount on Do Not Age's products, use the code word PATHWAYS. If you do that, you'll also be supporting this channel because it receives a small payment when people use that code word. If you'd like more information about glutathione or to follow up on the studies that I referred to in this video, please see the links directly below it. Thank you for watching. I will see you in the next video.